Hey everybody, good morning and welcome back to subsistence and today is our day of independence Independence from the hunter fortress. We're gonna go over and raid that Let me get a little something to eat here real fast. Make sure that's all topped off So something we're going to do. Okay, so don't be surprised. I talked about this before but We're gonna disassemble this. All right Everyone say goodbye. All right. It's gonna be fine. Everything should still be here when we put up the BCO again. So the reason why we're doing this is after we blow up the Hunter Fortress, um, the BCU that's at the North Outpost, the North Lake, that should be the uh, BCO that the new Hunter Fortress will respawn in that general area over there. Because I don't want them over here in the West Area. I want the West Area here for us and just for us. So it, it'll work out. It'll work out. Okay, so there that is. Let's put this down. I need to have a place to put a couple of storage containers. Oops, for all the loot we're going to get. Because I'm not going to be running back up to the base back and forth. Because that will definitely take us some time. I think two of them should do, right? You think so? Two? Yeah, I think that should be just fine. Where is it? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Okay. No claymore, no claymore, no claymore. We're okay, everyone. Okay, go, 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 go. Everybody in, everybody in. They now know we're here. They didn't before. Watch out, watch out. Look your corner, check your corners. Oh, good shot, good shot. All right, we got a bleeder. Let's take care of the bleeder. Okay, there's one guy over there. Let's go around this corner, check here, check the corners. Somebody, what was that, what was that, what was that? Okay, he's down, he's down. Good, excellent, not bad so far. Two down and I don't know how many left to go. Okay, this is kinda interesting. Looks a lot the same. Where is he? <laughs> oh, I love this forty four. Oh, oh, God. Okay, okay, okay. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Oh god, I'm stuck. Oh god, I'm stuck over here. <laughs> I think this stupid thing is getting in my way. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy sh I'm stuck. I I am okay. <laughs> Holy Holy hell! That was that was way too close. That was <laughs> I didn't oh god. Oh god, I didn't mean it to go like that. Okay, we're okay. Reload. Reload. Everyone okay? Everyone got their breath again? Shit. That's why I hate these stupid things. Oh my god. Okay, that kind of looks cool. I think that's just me walking on the carpet. Nice carpeting though. I like what they've done with the place. This is interesting. Oh, that's that's nice. Let's just go up. Oh, this is nice. I would like to have something like this. Yeah, I mean, we could do something like this. Could do that eventually. There we go. All right, I think, guys, I think we took the base. Okay, I think we got it now. This is going to be time for us to start looting and everything. 
Let's see, that looks like that shouldn't be too hard to hit. Let me just see if there's any that we want to use the grenades to blow up. Um, okay, that one. I can hit that one with a grenade tipped arrow, and I think there's one more down here. Actually, let's go get these bags before they despawn. Okay, looks good. Okay, that's good. And... Okay, that one looks... Actually, it looks like any one of these doors I can hit with a grenade tipped arrow and I probably could have just made six grenade tipped arrows and we would have been fine yeah I think that's I think that's okay uh, let's start from the top and work our way way down that way if we uh, blow up something it'll be accidentally blow up something will be on the top floor let's start with I think we could probably put this right here okay Okay, 240. Nice. Uh, it doesn't have a lot of hit points left in it. Hopefully there isn't a guy in there with a gun. Okay. Ooh, I got a lathe here. Wow. Wow, interesting. I wonder why they would have a lathe here. Well, of course, if you're going to have an elevator, you got to have that. I wonder, seriously, if they'd ever try blowing up our bases. Okay, shotgun shells. We've got some rifle rounds. Alloy. Some gunpowder. Boards and nails. And a grenade. Okay, that's cool. Nice to get a grenade back for the one that we used. That's everything up there. Uh, take that. Definitely use that for uh, mass. In here. Am I hungry? Yeah, I'm hungry. I'm alone. Oh, look at that. What is this? Rabbit casserole. Interesting. Yeah, let's just take it. All right? And you. Oh, tomato soup, man. So tell me, tell me you guys, do you like tomato or macaroni and tomato soup? Yeah, I definitely do. We're going to have to find a way to use or make some stuff while we're up here. Oh, wait. Was there a, was there another door up here? No. Okay, it's down here. Yeah, we got actually quite a few things here. That might be... That might be... Might start to be a little too full here. Yeah, let's head out. It's, uh... Oh, I'm getting a little lost here. Where, okay, here's the way down. Let's go throw some of the stuff outside. And head back. Oh, we might want to make that into something. Okay, let's see how far back we can go. How'd that do? Okay, not bad. 200 points not bad. I think we're far enough back here. We should be okay. Uh, it's a hundred. I'm going to keep the grenade in case something goes wildly wrong, you know? <laughs> keep it in case I miss the next door that we do. Okay. Diving station. Yeah, nothing in here. Okay, well, that's the way that goes. Got nails, 44, gunpowder, casings, okay, and cloth there. All right, not bad, not great, not great. And we did check this, right? I'll make sure there's nothing in the upgrade. I mean, I don't see anything there, but you never know. And we did, we did grab this, right? Oh, no, we didn't, we didn't. Totally did not grab that. And then down here, we don't need that. Now blow that open. Leave that alone. Oh, what do you got? Okay, I'll definitely take all this stuff. This upgrade has nothing in it. Yep. Let's empty out this bag. Lots of bars. Nice. Lots of fish oil. That's pretty good. Not bad. 
So maybe we'll have enough room for this, for whatever is in here. So let's just try this. Okay, a little further back, Steve. Good shot. 200 points. And... Oh, crap! What? What? Was I not far? You're kidding me, man. I thought I was more than far enough back. Oh, well. Oh, oh, a little bit fast there. Okay. Last items? Ah, nothing special. Nothing really good. That was a bummer. Okay, I think we have everything here. Um, let's go drop off the last of this before we blow it up, all right? I could just put it in here. That should do fine. Is that that? Can I put you in there? Nope. Oh, oops. Okay, whatever. Put that there and you there. No, no, see if you gotta do this one and that one. And I think I need a drink of water. Oh, we got two grenades. I didn't see that second one. Nice. Okay. Here we go. Okay, taking the dramatic walk. Dun, dun, da, da. See you later, buddy. All right. We had some good times here. Yeah, we did. Okay, everyone. Fuck, run. No, you're not running. Run, Steven. Run, run, run. <laughs> okay, let's get that down. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Honestly, don't know. Oh, yeah, explosion, yeah. Honest to God, don't know. I don't know when I, it'll be safe to run back in. Oh, yeah. I think it's done. I mean, it's going to slowly fall apart. Oh, somebody brought an axe to a gunfight. Ugh, I feel so sorry for you, buddy. I forgot about that. I forgot that after you blow it up, the sometimes you get a hunter or two or running, or a rogue. My guess that maybe that's a rogue. I mean, he doesn't have a shirt, so he's probably a rogue. There it is. There it is. What do you need to unlock? Where's the guy? That's just like hidden right up there or something? I don't know. Okay, guys. Cross our fingers. What goodies are we going to get? Come on. Come on. What, what have you got for What have you got for me? And. Okay. Okay, we got premium weapon parts. Okay, that's for upgrading. I think that's for the final level of upgrading any of your gun, the fourth level. I uh, I I don't know. <laughs> I don't, I shotgun shells, I guess that's good. Forty four rounds, yeah. More weapon parts. Um there we go. There we go. Every everybody everything's all emptied out in here. Except for I can probably grab that. Yeah, I'll skip the one that's upstairs, but there we go. There we go. It's it's all done. Now all it's left for it to do is to uh, slowly break apart. What I'm going to try to do, guys, is I'm going to try to sit here and do a time-lapse video of the Hunter Fortress falling apart. Let's just put them all down here. And then I'll put a video up of that so you guys can watch it. The time lapse. I think that'd be cool. Okay, so that's good enough for food. I got some I got some of you guys. So let's hit up that. Uh, where berries. I got some berries. I'm not going to eat that. 
So yeah, I'm just going to, uh, no food, no spoilage there. Okay, I think we could actually probably eat that. And I don't have any water. Right? Okay, I'm going to have to go back. Well, we'll run up to our base and we'll go get some water. I'm just going to leave this stuff here. All right? I don't want to miss the uh, base falling apart, but we don't have water. And I definitely got to have it. I got I got a ton of water. I'm just going to grab it. No! Don't do that! Oh, God. No. <laughs> it's going to break apart while I'm running back. Damn it! Oh, fuck. I should have brought some more water. Get out of my way, everybody. Get out of my way. Shit. Oh, God. Oh, God. I just got some water. <laughs> Fudge. Oh, damn it. I know I have a lockpick, guys. I have one lockpick. I left it back at the base. Oh, God. God damn it. It hasn't really started falling apart yet. So the plan is I'm going to hang right here. Ooh, wow. Nice. Shit, that looks better than what we got when we were inside the fortress. So my plan is just going to be to sit out here. See if you find a nice spot. Make sure you don't find the claymore. And just I'm just going to sit here and watch this. Uh, I'm going to record this thing. And if for some reason it's too dark tonight when we're recording, then then just forget it. Hopefully we okay, I'm just I'm just worried about the claymore. I want to get close enough so we can get a really good shot of this thing breaking apart. Because I know it's gonna well, I think it's gonna break apart. It should be gone, mostly gone by tomorrow morning. So I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna go a little bit. I'm gonna record this. And I might do a separate video that's just the time lapse of this. But, um, yeah, okay, I'm going to see you guys in the morning, okay? Just wait a moment. The video's not quite done. we got a little bit more to talk about. We're going to talk about it tomorrow, right? Okay, waited all night long. It did fall apart. Let me see if I get a little something to eat here. And got a couple berries left. Yeah, that was, uh, that was okay. Get my blueberry water. Oh, it's all gone. Yeah, I don't know if the claymore also went with it, but we're going to be very careful just in case. I'll grab some of our stuff, take it back to our base. I think we'll need to make about two runs here. And then, um, oops, uh, one, two. Okay, I'll just come back for that stuff. So what the plan's going to be here is... Just to reiterate what we said at the very beginning, now that I don't have a BCU here, the Hunter Fortress should respawn based to the location of the nearest base command unit, which is at the North Outpost. And after I get everything cleared out here, I am going to head up north and I would do a little building of the outpost. We've got a little stuck there. Because uh, the uh, North Lake Outpost doesn't really have a lot going on. It's just a foundation and a single wall with a base command unit and storage. But, um, you know, the, the plan will be to build that up a little bit. It's not going to be as big or as busy as this one. But we definitely will have it over there. Let me start getting this stuff put away. And of course, I understand with the base command unit not being here, all the stuff is going to start to rot or just disappear. That's fine. That's fine. We'll go out and farm some more of this stuff. Just get that stuff put away. Got a little blueberry water. Um, I'm just going to take the things that I need to build up with me. And then as I discover things that I definitely need, I'll come back here, grab stuff, and bring it up there. But we're not going to spend a lot of time up at the north uh, outpost. We're mostly we're mostly there just to see if the uh, if the hunter fortress reforms out there. As soon as we see that it's reformed out there, I'm gonna head back down here and probably do some work. Well, it'll all be depend on whether or not the uh, 
Hunter Fortress does respawn up there. I mean, it could it could totally trick us. It could totally try to respawn back down here, which is definitely not where we want it to be. All right, we've got just a little bit more to get down there. I think I think everything would be fine. I think everything in there, everything that we crafted, will still be there by the time uh, everything is okay and we can come back here. Because soon as soon as the Hunter Fortress is up. I'll come back here, I'll put a base command unit in, and even though that base command unit won't generate its own power, because it's the second one, because the first one is going to be at the north base, which is totally fine, that's what I was planning, uh, as soon as the hunter fortress has respawned somewhere that's not down here, and it's completely and totally rebuilt again, which is going to take months in game, because that's, I guess that's how it's going to work out now. Is I thought it before it took a month, but now it's like months instead. Let me make sure a guy isn't sneaking up behind us. Let me grab this. As soon as that is all done, then we'll probably switch the base command units. But I'll make sure I don't make the mistake I made before. Because I think what happened is when I switched the base command units the first time in early game, I didn't put up a new base command unit at the uh, the north uh, lake, the north outpost base, and I think that caused the uh, the uh, hunter fortress to bug out, and then it reformed down here. So that's it. Um, I'm gonna put up a separate video time lapse of the uh, hunter fortress here uh, coming apart. It's kind of cool, and actually, it didn't come apart till the morning. So the light is okay. You can actually watch it. So I sat all night and listened to all sorts of booms and bangs. But finally, once the sun came up, shit, shit went down and so did the fortress. So anyway, guys, that'll be it for this video. Yeah, next video will be up at the North Lake. We'll do a little building in the outpost, you know, make it a little bit better than what it is. So we can set that up for future raids and everything. Eventually, we'll make our way back down here. We'll use this again. Keep... And I'll see you guys in the next video, okay? Later, dudes.